Hey there guys, it's Metro, and we are getting our revenge on the Zandalari. <laughs> After dying to them in the very beginning of the playthrough, we are now appropriate level to fight them. They actually scale up all the way, it looks like, so that's cool. I killed a war scout before, it didn't give anything at all. It just gave a little bit of whatever the resource, bronze, and that's it. I think it gave me a gem maybe, and that's it. They used to give like tokens for rep too, but I guess not anymore. But yeah, I'm gonna head in these out. I'm queued up for LFRs again. We'll see if we get in. And then I guess that's the way forward, unless something goes on all of a sudden. So that gave no experience, I think. But we did get two charges, or two threads or whatever, and then 105. That's pretty good, 105 bronze from that guy. I'm gonna go see what it looks like the solo stuff. Whatever, we don't need the quest. 119k? Oh, they have no health at all. Alright, very, very soloable. Oh well, that's unfortunate. Okay, they have mechanics. Might need weak horrors if we're gonna do this. Let's just see if they give experience or not. Uh, no. 24 each. Let's try to kill the boss. See if the boss gives experience. I don't think you need to pull... Oh, maybe you do. I don't remember what you actually need to pull here and what you don't. That is why I don't have damage numbers on the screen, by the way. Like, what the fuck? How can anybody play with those on? We just got like mad stuff from it though. All right, two million health. So that's like the same as the Warbringer. Let's try to kill him and see what happens. I don't remember how to do this mechanic. I think it just gradually grows and you're meant to soak it. I don't know what happens if it gets to the middle though. Not able to grip him. Oh. Presumably, we don't want to be standing in that. Oh, he's gonna do damage. And he one shot us. Okay. So we'd have to actually know the mechanics, I guess. We have to kill the adds, I think. I bet what we can do is pull all this trash onto him. Or die before that happens cool all right well I guess dungeons are actually hard or something I don't know what's going on why I just got smacked like that this is just a normal dungeon too let's try pulling the globs on at least because they're they shouldn't be hard or I guess it's too dangerous I'm getting my ass kicked here It's not really making him die any faster. Oh, but this is not triggering the fail of the mechanic? That's curious. Oh, he's just gonna detonate it though, because it's that full. Alright, yeah, we're gonna be able to do this one. Oh, it didn't kill us though. Oh. Wait, what? Why didn't it kill us? I guess we'll find out if we can survive it. Maybe it is. Is he gonna detonate it again? If so, I'll save AMS for it or vamp blood for it. Allow me to show you the power of Aver Alchemy. Yeah, it didn't even do damage. Didn't even break the AMS. 
Not sure why we died the first time. Very soloable though. This guy's only a normal boss and does scale up it looks like, but I'd imagine at 70 we'd be probably able to solo heroics no problem. I don't know like what the difference between heroics and normal are in this version of the game. Looks like he will die here. We should have probably listed. That's probably the only guy we're doing. I imagine the rest is not going to be worth doing. Uh, I gave 4k. But no experience buff from killing it, like in LFR. I mean, there's nothing else to do. It's not like... If there's any other way to gain experience right now that would be worth our time. I gotta turn these off though for sure after this. That's like not even a challenge to solo it though. All right, let's see. Fun to have for real leveling challenges, but not so much this. Oh yeah, so we just got the death's advance one. I wonder what happens if we put that on. Probably nothing. Or maybe it gives us a second, like, charge of it. Like a second spell of it. Looks like people are only doing this one now. Chick told me you can just keep queuing up for the same one over and over again, so I'm gonna take his word for that. when we come back out the ancient vaults of the mogu untouched by time for thousands of years who knows what secrets await this Many is why people are doing this then because you can pull all this shit on top of the have your wits about time. and then brittle them or whatever yeah see that just did like 20 percent of the mob's health right there and we didn't even have all the mobs in here. Yeah, that's fast. That's a good way to kill trash. the dang at least I guess this is how we're leveling then not what I expected but well, we're not allowed to do it in here or something oh we're still in combat I guess is why I fear what we may find within let's not be this let's not do this if <laughs> this is the way the only way to level from 60 to 70 I won't be leveling characters to 70 I guess there's not necessarily a reason to though right like this is just optional I can get bronze at 60. I just, eh, yeah, fuck it. It doesn't matter to me. Leveling challenges to 60 only, which was not that slow, but it's going to get a lot faster, I guess. So it'd be very short leveling challenges. More and more looking like I'll probably just end up doing the thing where we try to get character power enough to solo everything. I can't imagine I'll ever be able to solo the raid if this is what LFR looks like. Although this is with 25 people. Raid doesn't necessarily need to uh, be done with 25 people. You can do it with 10, right?
Oh, that's a blood decay. What? Epicent? Oh, that he used the item. Yeah, okay. What's our cloak looking like right now? Is that the max? Oh, I think that's the max. Oh no, there's a lot more. 22,000 threads, 2200 threads. I definitely didn't want to just do this one wing over and over again, but at least it's a dungeon I, a raid I really like. Leave it to wild players to so just do the most efficient thing and nothing else. Alright, so we're here. And yeah, it's pretty much two full ballers each time. And then we gain three each things each time as well, it looks like. Again. Maybe we should look this for an actual raid, though, huh? We have seen oh, plus we're getting a, an experience once till I assume that's helping. Yeah, that's a good use of that right there. It's just too boring, dude. This is not enjoyable. I can't do this for another three... Well, it's probably more than three hours. I don't know how long it would take to level this way because the Q is a big part of the actual wait time and everything. Presumably we'll get it. It will go faster and faster because we keep getting more and more experienced ones. Our cloak is now up to 174. Time to play, friends. You remember to actually loot. I don't know if I looted Garishal. <laughs> Last time I did this. It be dying time now. So it's just a straight up nuke, like doesn't do a single fucking mechanic, it looks like. I don't even remember what this boss was meant to do, but it doesn't look like he's doing a single thing here. It's supposed to cross over, I guess, for some reason, who knows why. Not me. And never lose control. From the man who stole the world. Dim bada bim 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 do 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 There's no music in this street either. See, I didn't start playing with sound on until late mob, so I don't know. This would have been the last expansion where I didn't have sound on. Alright, so we didn't even get a full half of a level from that. So that ain't good. See how long the queue is, I guess. We're still in queues for the other ones? Yeah. If those would pop, then that would make it a lot easier, but. So, is there any other way to get experience? I don't know. Since we did the LFR, we can turn that thing in at least. Do you want? 
don't. Give a little bit at least. A lot of mastery. I don't know, I guess we just get way more mastery than other stats. It's on gear too, it's like not even, I don't know. Spearwalker's Grace is a good one, though. Oh, yeah, let's try Death's Advance on the character and see what happens. Up to 24k bronze now, too. Yeah, it's just a third use of it. Okay, that's kind of cool. Who would that be the best for? Mage, maybe? Third blink charge? Glad we were able to confirm that at least. Oh, we actually have... Another one of those. Getting lots of gems, at least. Greetings, traveler. That's a scenario quest. All right. Uh, the queue is seven minutes now, so it's basically probably like less than fifteen minutes for half a level. You are most welcome. Are these dailies? Hello. What is your hurry? Slow down. Welcome. You know what we should do? Alright, let's drop all these. What we should do is go to the timeless aisle. I bet there's stuff there, because, like, that's where we started, right? That's got to be important. It's got to have some relevance to the playthrough at some point. Maybe not again until 70, but... There's a quest in the veil to go to the timeless isle, so that's what we can do while we wait. We still haven't gotten any. Oh, what happened here? We never put a third thing in. Uh, but we still never uh, got rings or trinkets, though. Jix linked one that he saw somebody had a trinket on, but... Yeah, maybe we should try to look for a raid group, too. Nothing. I mean, cheer sign up. Not sure why anybody would invite anybody over anybody else, but Wam bam 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 and bam Shoo do 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 I think the Yeah, it's over there. Lord Walker Chow has it. Oh yeah, how is our actual damage? That one that is supposed to do something with your shields doesn't seem to be on there. I don't even see it. Is it that one? Nope. 
Is this the uh, LFR queue? What is this that I'm doing right now? Is this hello or goodbye? <laughs> Quickly get to the timeless aisle, I guess. It's just gonna be this one over and over again. That's the ancient vaults of the mold. Not surprising, there's tricks again. By time not surprising, but boring as fuck, honestly. Who knows what secrets await? Many young Pandaran warriors have died into this tomb. Have your wits about you. You know, you're killing them too fast. Alright, that's really stupid. I guess maybe that was me and him. Somehow we did insane damage. Storm overload. We just fucked ourselves there big time. No, not significantly anyway at the end of the day, but. God, I fucking miss Mop Man, I really do. This was the peak, like this was in, the guild was in its prime state and everything was optimistic and like the future looked bright for everything. and. when I had the most fun playing WoW with other people. I don't know why people leave though. That's what made me think it wasn't worth doing it on the same... Like, I thought we'd have to do all the different LFRs. It's like, why leave after one pull? I guess because there's no queue time and that's the fastest EXP per hour or something? I don't know. Like, I feel like there's got to be a queue time. Surely it's faster to stay. Why are so many people blood? We have three tanks in here? I can't even tell. Or did Chicks wait, did Chicks leave? No, he's there. Oh he is he's a DPS. It says vengeance though. The stories were true. We have disturbed what should not have been. I don't know. Uh, we definitely won't be using our orb on the pull here. Last time we fucked it all up. Oh, spirit bomb. Still top. No, Arcanist edge. Yeah, that's the one that I thought. Did I not put that on? Cause I don't even have that. I don't think I put it on. Yeah, no, I never put it on. I was going to, and I guess I didn't for some reason. Nullification barrier. Who even wants that? Not me. Well, definitely a strange, definitely a won't, you know, a disappointing, disappointing ending. I mean, we're not, probably not even going to finish this now at this rate. I'm not sure I'll even continue to record this because there's nothing to record. Just doing the same LFR bosses over and over again. Darkness Edge, yeah, okay. Looks like the combo, we gotta get that on. Dead now, honestly, we gotta take one of these things out. Not sure what our worst one is, but we should be able to identify it quickly. Meteor Storm. I did zero damage for some reason. Does that never do damage, maybe? Wait, we have an empty one, what the fuck? We have seen a bang. The Zandalari, a 
Well, I meant to put that in there, and I think I just never did or something. They must seek the legendary weapon within the depths of the vault. I am sorry I did not tell you earlier. It's just hard to like. I know a lot of people probably like this kind of stuff, and it's probably weird to say, but like, especially since I was like leveling the way I was, like, that's kind of autopilot too. But like, this is so boring. Like, I don't even feel like I need to be here for this. To like, I can literally just AFK for this. It just makes it really hard to stay engaged. Like, I just don't care to even press my CDs, my spells, when everything's this easy and basic. Uh, this is like LFR on LFR steroids. Finally, something easier than classic. Time to play. Guys, transmog now. It's been dying time now. Here, we actually stunned the boss. What the hell? as well again. The extra vamp blood CD reduction will be nice. Barely even get a second use of our spells in this fight. There we go. <laughs> yeah, that's overpowered actually. Holy shit. It's a good one for a tank. Oh, Paris at the end of the spring, finally. I guess we'll see a different vista at least. I have to do the same thing over and over again. Oh yeah, okay. Wait, these guys are level 20. Oh, we can't actually fly here. Yeah, this is like the actual intro place again. I thought it would be phased or something. These are just the same vendors as we would have seen earlier, right? Oh, these guys are all level 20. What about the Celestials? What, too many people declined or something? This place, a Pandaren Because this intro is usually pretty good, Mystery. exp wise as well. I've been here for hours, and the sun hasn't moved. Exactly, time is frozen in perpetuity. Cause and effect. Indrin. I do like it. What could create such a thing? Mm-hmm. Yeah, we got gear. I keep forgetting to look at the gear. A lot of leech. One ander. Nothing yet. You don't really get anything from LFR other than experience. I got two pieces of gear, I guess, but yeah, they're not really what I want. Tell me of your travel. What wisdom stranded on this island? You will find the most dangerous creatures in all of. Pandora. Oh yeah, we need to get coins. Explore if you must, Prince Anduin, but be cautious.
would be like the most efficient way to get and probably go to the elites because we definitely are able to kill anything we want on here oh yeah no there's these like treasures too i forgot about that let's see if they get bronze that must mean that must be what they meant when they said treasures the isle has tons of treasures on it Wait, oh shit. Did you see how much experience we're getting? Did not, oh yeah, did it get bronze? I can't really tell if... Did we get a lot from that? I saw a thousand, I'm pretty sure. kill some of these guys these guys are all casters though, I think aren't they there's just no oh, there's people here uh, I mean it looks like that gave a good amount that didn't give anything other than we did get bronze from it at least uh, let's try to get this treasure if I can remember how to do it I think you need to be mounted for... Okay, you just stay mounted for all of them. I don't know why I was thinking of something else, maybe. Uh, that gave a bunch of coins, and I can't really tell. Like, the bronze is there in the chat, but... Is that bronze from a previous kill or something? Let's try killing the name guys, or the big guys. This would be only slightly less boring than LFR, but at least we'd have a nice setting to do it in. Yeah, they're giving a thousand each. Is it only the cats? Each giving a thousand, yep. What a wild, strange, wild ride this has been. This guy better give like 10,000, otherwise he's not worth it. Even with all my overpowered shit, it's not doing much. That was so weird how he stunned Garajal. What was that about? I know, that gives the exact same amount as everything else we fought. That's very strange. And likely a bug. What would be the most like efficient and fun stuff to kill over and over again? I guess these are not bad, but they're kind of annoying because they keep jumping around and stuff. Just got 14 mastery from that too. Try to find some non-elites that are easier to pull. Because if everything gives the same, then obviously we want to just find the easiest to kill things. There's not really a lot of options. What about the frogs? The frogs are always... Oh, actually, maybe in here. I know, these are elites. No, Zarahim, yeah. Fuck, man. That dude's been gone from the company so, so long, I'm surprised the reference is still in the game.
That was our original contact in Wad that we had in the inside. Long time ago. We got wrists. Everything's leech. What's in the chest? Just coins and bronze. That rare down here? No, those are upstairs. That guy's level 60, trying to level 2, probably. Get pounced. I was only given 600, but is it because we're splitting it with this guy? Probably. You stay there. Are they fighting each other, these ones? Yep. back to the I guess yeah this is just the formula and just queue farm mobs while you wait we got mad threads though I cannot believe how many threads we're getting crit that's a lot of crit Look at it after the dungeon or after the raid because I would say we're going to get even more here. Of the moon, no jicks this time. Untouched by time for thousands of years. Who knows what secrets await? Many young Pandaren warriors have vanished. You need to make sure they actually get here before people pop, pop off. Have your wits about you. There we go. Oh, okay, that's... That's it. Fucking boss didn't even. I don't even think it auto attacked anybody. The door mechanism seems to have activated with the demise of the guardians. I fear. That's faster than what we were doing, guys. Oh, those shoulders have three sockets. There's always a couple people who leave, though. It makes me wonder if they're doing something. Really smart. To have awakened a spirit of some kind. Link it for the guy, I just don't know. If... I don't even know where I have it. I know I have it though. The stories were true. We have disturbed. No, I have to do it later. Sorry, buddy. These are the horns of the dead. It's kind of sad, though, that the passive ones are just so much stronger than this three minute CD one. So I need to loot though. Gotta make sure I loot the trash too, because that's all power we're leaving on the table. I wonder what happens. Is there a cap? We haven't gotten. We're still at 174. I wonder if that's a cap. We just got unlucky, I guess.
This guy says, is there a way to get next in rings achievements? Like what? That guy's ans answering, that guy's asking the question I have. The good ones. That's the chick's answer. Let me go loot this. Fang the accursed was betrayed by four emperors of the Mogul. Didn't seem to have anything with browns on it. Destroyed each time only to rise again. This is not the last we have seen. Oh, is this what a time runner's idol is? It's a trinket, maybe? Ancient allies of the Mogul. They must seek. Look at all this shit. It's all from achievements, though. I didn't realize. I am sorry I did not tell you earlier. These claw of Eternus. A weapon of unimaginable power. Stop them. Realm first. Huh? I will stay behind and investigate. I know they said they're getting rid of that, but it's still weird that there's achievements and stuff and giving actual rewards. We're doing be needing what's back that way anyhow. Time Runner's Beacon. These are appearances only, okay. Time to play. I mean, it doesn't really seem like... That's just all that stuff. Rep is all caches. It be dying time now. Green thing is this? That's the life storm, maybe. I see like flowers in the ground. I remember reading about that one. Whoa! What did I slay? What the fuck? Have, what's killing these guys? Probably the trinket, or whatever, the one is like a tinker, I mean. It does damage to your party, basically. Okay. We dinged. It's not been that slow. I don't know what our level was though, but I think it's probably under a half hour. Still giving the same amount, so that's good. Okay, it looks like everything gives the exact same amount. Which is interesting. All right, we finally have slap hands. See if that stuns enemies too. Gear, let's see. Three slots, the helmet we definitely want. I just don't really want the stuff that doesn't have actual player power to it. Too shabby though. Up to 26k bronze. I really want to try to get to 70. I mean, I guess at this rate, we definitely know the formula. It's just going to take a while. But yeah, I want to try to get to 70 and have a, a measure of how many different bronze, how much bronze we gain just naturally. Uh, see, I use Vamp Blood and Slap Bands at the same time there, so I don't know. 
Yeah, these are giving the same. We just gotta be careful and not getting killed. I'm pretty sure AMS uh, stops the stacks, but I don't know for sure. This is too dangerous. Don't want to die here. They are very good in terms of distance from each other, though. So those aren't really good, but they're pretty uh, solid if I could not die to them. Let's continue to search for a good spot. Don't think there's many options left, though. I think maybe the Chushi landing, but I'm pretty sure those mobs are all going to be level 20. Was somebody fighting the Celestial? Oh, shit. Really, it's probably just the Tigers at this point. There's so many of them right here. It just sucks because... Okay, now Slappy Ends does not apply the thing. So it's just da Dancing Room Open and Vampiric Blood. Which is fine, really, because the more haste we get, the more we're going to have those up anyway. Did somebody kill it already? Let's see if these mobs give full experience. Yes, they do. All right. Yeah, here we go. This is our spot. Not full. Some are not giving full, but either way, there's like a million of them. And look at they're respawning already. And they're giving that too, yeah. Yeah, these small chicks are only giving 600 each. Long ago, the Jade Serpent instructed me to purify my spirit and become one with the land. He's actually doing the world boss, so it's probably worth tagging that, right? Or is, is not. Nobody's here. No, there's not the even. Lesson of true wisdom lies within I don't know. Dear heroes. 13 million, though. We're not solving that, so. When faced with overwhelming darkness, will you make the right. It's weird, though, because. No, I guess we're still only at 174. I'm not sure if that's bad luck or if it's capped at this point, but we haven't seen any actual experience gains. The question I have now is my... Like, I guess this is still the best way, but it's given the exact same amount level after level, so... What about here? What's here? Really see. Looks like it's good. Yep, it's another great one. Hard to tell if this is faster or not than LFR, but... It looks like somebody else is here, though.
Or what? Why are their mobs dead but nobody? Oh, what is that thing? Evermaw. I forgot about that fella. I swear there was more mobs like that somewhere here. Guess we're just back to the yellow mobs in the middle area. experience although I don't know that he is to be honest you don't even need to be here bro why don't you go fucking level elsewhere now we're getting a little bit more did we get more experience ah we did okay so that is confirming all the problems I was worried about not being real there's any mobs up here what about like turtles and shit on the beaches nothing here anyway well I guess we're almost done with this quest so we might as well finish this anyway that again Basically, just want to get down here and not die and have threat. Not enough players had it though. I guess a lot of the mobs didn't make it down as well, but. This should get us the next level though. Yeah, with the combination of the two options, we can pretty much get a level every queue, it looks like. If we can continue to be farming on the aisle by ourselves. This has got to be bugged though, right? Surely, those, I don't know, there's something seriously wrong with the way experience. I don't think they want you to do it like this, but maybe. Oh, can you actually start that without killing this? Well, 
Wouldn't mind trying a normal raid though, definitely. Not dodgeable, I guess. I don't know what that even is. I need to be tanking to do good damage? Why is my damage so low? I guess I need bigger death strikes. Oh, I didn't use my main CDs on this because I used it on the trash. Guess we just have really actual damage healers. Final verdict is actually at the top of the guy's chart, so. destroyed each time only to rise again i love this raid because it's like a fucking like this history lesson too it's really cool this is why mop day. was so good because it really did feel like you went to a whole different like Ancient it felt like a whole different game like it does not feel like wow especially the way they're delivering the content and the story it's like this is not like anything that's ever been in a while maybe karazhan a little bit but now nah, mostly uh Totally foreign to WoW, it feels like. I will stay behind and investigate this I'm gonna finish this one though. I'm gonna take a little break after this. And we will finish it up today, it looks like, for sure. So shocked that we're actually stunning the boss. I'm right, taking like a lot of damage here, though. Huh? That had to hurt. Melee, 68k. What? Only like our fourth death in the playthrough, but didn't expect to see it in LFR. Gotta, oh, don't tell me we gotta run all the way back. Oh, LFR queue for that too. Shit. I'm gonna miss the experience. Can't imagine anybody would res me, but I probably should have waited for the res. But it ain't no tea. Take your trinkets. I be going now. I shouldn't have taken that. Find a new home for my sword. Okay, we got it. That was the level there too. That's funny. All right, we'll do this too, and then that'll be it. This is probably gonna be way worse because there's not an easy first boss thing to do.
Yeah, my, is my gear broken or something? Why am I taking so much damage? Maybe this is just normal and I'm just... Because I went full offensive, I'm squishy as fuck. I love this raid though, it's definitely one of my favorite raids ever. I guess it's all the bosses in LFR, right? Pretty sure we have to kill one at a time here, which is gonna kinda suck. I don't remember the fights at all. Never tanked them before in my life. Okay, well, let's just take them together, I guess. Cleave them down, I guess. I don't know. Move him. That means they're healing now, I guess. Yeah, I was straight up dead, yeah. I don't know what's happening with my character right now. Went from being like zero, like a crushing shit, to getting one shot. So I don't know. This was not going to be a fast alternative, but this is making it even worse. Oh, wait, what just happened now? Why is he still all of a sudden? Really need to take some time and get my uh, UI set up. I need to kill this, I guess? Haste increase. <laughs> fucking hits so goddamn hard, dude. I, is it people fucking with this stupid... I have no idea, because I'm like getting hit for like 100% of my health and then I'm not dying somehow. I don't know why. It doesn't look like it's from the actual boss this time, unlike the other one. Oh, we just got epic ones. No, the waters. I must resist. I shall not fear. I don't know if that's from the raid that we got epic ones. Where are we pinging? Oh, right. Yeah, the boss is here, yeah. happening right now. Dug in. To, like clear that debuff, right? I think it was like a tree on Mythic or whatever. I don't remember this raid very well at all. 
was not a raid we did a ton, I don't think. I don't think it was like super valuable and I think it was a lot harder than the other two. Four bosses in here, though, I think. Maybe even five? I think it's four, yeah. Just don't know what the stacking thing is for and why it'd be important for me to clear, so I'm just gonna stay out here. Hopefully brute force. It looks like if I parry, I live, and if I don't, then I die. <laughs> Alright, that's the end of the fight. Oh, wait, is it? No, I guess not. <coughs> I don't remember this fight at all. I think there was, like, some kind of tree. Was that an achievement, maybe? I remember fucking around with some kind of tree on something in here. These are giving experience too, that's cool. Only 31 experience, but they are giving experience. What is that? Is that a light well? That's still in the game? No. That guy just got one shot by that? That's funny. And then too long. said, no, that's the guy got one shot. We have to heal him, right? Yeah, okay. Heal him up. Crazy priest solo in the fucking fight. The only one who probably knows what he's doing. Wait, the fucking second. That's not even a... It is, it is a resto shaman. Okay, forget it. Oh, we're not done. You have to heal him multiple times. I thank you, stranger. I have been free. Okay, can't really tell if it's given more experience or not, but we're getting epic things instead, so that's pretty cool. Avoidance. No, there's a raid. There's a boss there too, yeah. Li Shi, right? This one I don't remember a second. I really don't know this raid at all, I guess. I can't remember anything about it. I feel like we must not have done it a lot. Art of Fear was another one that I remember, but this one I don't. Attacking a tank? Oh yeah, he's attacking that guy, Devil Rush. I think he's splashing on other people. What do we have to do, kill him? This one feels like a lot different tuning than the previous one though. You have to drop AOE or something. I can't remember how it works. This is certainly a very unique leveling challenge. <laughs> I don't think I've ever done a breed LFR in a, in a leveling challenge.
This last boss is gonna be a mess if I remember correctly. It has tons of mechanics. Just advanced, we didn't have that back in the day. Obviously, I wasn't even playing a Death Knight, so I definitely didn't have it. Not sure what the purpose of these guys are. Just gotta kill them quick, I guess. But they're just horrendous now all of a sudden. I don't know what the difference is. Did they nerf the shit maybe and hot fixed it? Can I inspect them? Try to inspect people and see if they have something that I don't have. Alright. Did I was I it, it was so cloudy. Post this in here for him. Oh, that just gave 56k. I wonder if that's the same amount as always. Yeah, let's see what happens here. I don't know this one. Shaw Fear. What a great fucking expansion, man. It really was. Okay, who knows? Let's see. Stand in that, I think. It's a buff, isn't it? Only the tank stands in it, I believe. Blocks damage or something, if I remember correctly. I don't seem to have a buff from it, so I'm not sure. Oh, is that the buff? Champion of Light. I can't see it's happening too quick. Yeah, okay, I remember this. What are these for? Oh, resource regeneration. I think this is probably pretty basic on Elefaria. I think on regular difficulties you had to go and do it yourself, but now it just goes for you forces people to go. This is a common thing in LFR. I don't know what the ads are for. A couple people needed to go and kill them, I think. On Mythic, there's like a second phase and there's like a fucking intermission or like a checkpoint or something. It's basically like a second boss. You beat this version of the boss, then you fought like a real version of the boss, I think. But it was all one fight. But I think, I think it was like a checkpoint or something. I never did it on Mythic, but I remember that. I 
it's sending me away. Or no, I'm just large because of the standing in this thing, I guess. Yeah, I don't know if the threads are by level or why I'm getting epic ones now. But since I'm 65, it would make sense. Okay. Oh. All right, I'm gonna go. Hands starting to hurt, honestly. But, very wild. Oh yeah. Let me quickly get in a good spot and then we'll log out. This guy's got a lot of health. Now we're getting 14, so we must have gained a lot. Huh, I guess not. Didn't, I don't think we gained a lot. How are we doing on gems too? We got a lot of gems. Oh, this is a something from the island, I think. Let's go back to our f favorite spot. We'll kill them again and then log out. I guess from doing the raid, we got this. Probably from doing that raid the first time and clearing it, we got that. Yeah, there was like an achievement to clear it, right? Keep getting helmets with crit, fortunately. Shoulders, that's an upgrade. We gotta put that on. It's like a massive, massive, massive upgrade. Let me do that before we stop. And we now have another slot free. So I have no idea at this point. Sure, that one sounds good. Oh yeah, it's just because of the level. Yep. So that's the main reason why you want to level. So otherwise you're just gonna get, like not, your, your power's gonna be capped pretty much. Okay, well, anyway, oh, they're back already, fuck. <laughs> it's almost like, if it respawned infinitely, you would never leave the spot, I feel like. Dead. Huh. I don't understand, I need the weak ores, man. I need to get my health in the middle of the screen, because it's starting, I don't know if it's just because I'm leveling up or what, but... times when I just like don't live like I straight up don't like I'm just dead and I have no idea why because I don't feel like I should be dead I can't really see my health bar so I'm not really sure what the reason would be Oh god, don't do this to me, man. I want to take a break. And get the level, I guess.
Uh, is somebody fighting them or why are they out? I don't get it. Alright, there's the level. Make sure nothing changes either way. Kill this guy. Okay, 70. Uh, we're actually getting less experience now, which is a little worrying some. Ah, but anyway. I am going to stop here for now. We will be back and get four more levels in whatever, hopefully, the next episode. So thank you for watching. We will see you guys in the next one.